Okay, this is a video to show how to create some drilled holes passing through the ID to the OD. I'm going to start out by creating some cylinders for these drilled holes. First, I'm going to change the color to something slightly different. Turn off the shading. And I'm going to go into Create Surface Ruled. What I'm going to do is I'm going to pick... Oh, let's say the top of that hole. Notice it started at 3 o'clock. It's going clockwise. Make sure the other one starts at the same spot and goes the same direction. So there's the two ruled chains. Hit OK. There's the surface. I'm going to apply that one. And now I'm going to use the arrow to slide over here. And I'm going to try and do that same thing to this one. I'm going to pick uh, this one and also this one. Starting and stopping in the same place, going the same direction. All right, there's our surfaces. Now, we need to do some surface trimming. One thing to keep in mind about surface trimming is the surface must, surfaces must completely intersect each other, otherwise it will not work. These cylinders do not extend far enough past the ID bore, and this top surface looks like it's already been trimmed. I need to untrim that one, and I also need to extend these cylinders. First, I'm going to extend the cylinders. That can be done by going to Create Surface, and I'm just going to use Extend. I am going to pick this cylinder, and I get an arrowhead. It says, which edge do you want to extend? So you slide it up and dink it on the top circle, click it. You can adjust how far you're extending it with right here. Uh, just as long as it extends beyond it, it's good enough. Apply that one. Pick this next one. Slide up and click on the circle edge. And we're going to extend these little guys down here by picking the surface and picking the bottom edge. Okay, we're done with extensions. Now, I really need to get rid of this, uh, this there's like a gap here between the blue surface and the, the blue OD and the purple cylinder. So that one I'm going to untrim. So we've got to create surface, untrim. Which surface are you untrimming? This OD face. Okay, that. So now you see it's a complete cylinder all the way around. Okay, now we can start trimming surface to surface. So we go up to create surface. We're trimming a surface to another set of surfaces. Prompt says select the first set of surfaces and press enter. By the way, the green ball icon is also enter. One thing to keep in mind with this there are two sets of surfaces. Uh, one set of surfaces could be multiple surfaces, but the other set has to be a single surface. In this case, they're both single surfaces. So it's asked me to pick my first set. Okay. Uh, this is my first set. Hit enter or the green ball. So I hit the green ball. Then it says pick your second set. It doesn't matter where you pick it, but your second set is this cylinder, green ball. Now you got to repick your first surface. And it's asking you, select the area to keep. Well, anything out here is what we want to keep. What we don't want to keep is inside the middle of that hole. So as long as the, um, that arrowhead that's moving around, as long as it's outside, just click there. And then we pick the other surface, but we don't want to keep it up here. I want to slide down and keep the cylinder down here. And it trims off both of them because our toolbar here is set to trim both and it deletes the remaining surfaces. Okay, we can apply that, and now we do the next one. This is one set of surfaces, green ball. This cylinder is the other set of green of surfaces, green ball. Now we pick the first set, keep it up here. Second set, keep it down low. Apply that. Same thing on the bottom. This ID bore is one set, green ball. This cylinder is the second set, green ball. Pick the first set again, keep it anywhere over here. Pick the second set, slide up above inside part, part here, keep that. You can see that trimmed away. Apply that. This is my first set, green ball. This is my second set, green ball. Then we go back to pick the first set, keep anywhere not inside of that hole. Out here would be good. This cylinder, but slide up, keep it up here. Okay, we're done. There's your trimming. Part looks good. 
That concludes this video. Thanks.